Okay, sweetheart, do you remember ages ago playing a wee listening game with me? And every time you heard a wee sound turn on, like this one, popping a counter into the yellow bowl, do you remember doing that with me? We're just going to have a little practice, sweetie. So next time it turns on, can you pop one of those in there for me? Wait for it to turn on though, remember? Great work, good girl. And one more practice. Whoop, wait for it to turn on. Listen. Good job. And once more, just to make sure. You are awesome. So good at this. We're just going to give you your real turn now. Remember to listen for the really tinies. Oh, good work. Good girl. We'll just tuck this under your arm. Good job, sweetheart. Fantastic. Good work. Awesome listening, darling. Terrific. You are so good at this. Good work. Awesome listening, darling. You are so good at this. You are so good at this. All done. You were just wonderful. You did so well doing all that listening for me, honey. So I'm just going to check your ears with this little computer as well. Okay, my darling. Good job. Okay, remember, we'll turn it on so a big circle comes up on the front. There we go. Just going to check your ears with this wee machine, darling. Good job. Beautiful. And one more time. Oh, you're so good. There we go. Good job, sweet. And one more time on that side. You are just a treasure. There we go. Sia Ila has been rescreened and her test result is audiometry refer, tympanometry right pass, left refer and record physical volume. Many children will pass pathway one at rescreen and no further action will be required. Sia Ila responded correctly to all frequencies and intensities presented in her right ear and to 30 decibels at 500 hertz in her left ear. Once again, she failed to respond to 20 dB at 1000 Hz in her left ear. At this point in the screen, VHTs must make a choice. Either stop the screen and remove the headphones, or continue to screen with pathway two, then go to tympanometry and record the results. The transition from pathway one to pathway two should be seamless. Leave the headphones in place and proceed to test using pathway two. When a child is concentrating well, this is a good option as it enables the VHT to identify and record the quietest sounds responded to in each frequency. Note on rescreen pathway one, Sia Ela passed in the right ear, so the VHT tests her left ear only with pathway two. Pathway two always begins at 40 decibels for each frequency. Intensity will reduce by five decibel steps 
until 25 decibels is achieved at 1000, 2000, 4000 hertz and at 30 decibels at 500 hertz respectively or there is no response. All responses are recorded at the lowest decibel level at which the child responded.